Welcome back to Viewworks VX View Quick Guide. My name is Claire Pian, and today's video will be on some of the key post processing tools you can use after extra exposure. You'll see diverse icons here in the toolbar. Let's take a closer look at the ones here. First, Change Step. As the name implies, Change Step allows you to change the step information you're currently working on. You might need this function when you have simply pinned in the wrong information. For example, you'll see that the thumbnail indicates a different body part from the x-ray image. To correct this, click on the button here. You'll see the step list window, find the correct body part, projection, and patient size information. When you're done, click OK. You'll see that step information has changed on the thumbnail. But this can also be a useful function when you have an urgent patient coming in. In this case, just go for extra exposure immediately and change the step and patient information later with the change step function. For your information, you can also use move image or edit function to move an image to another step or to change the step information. Second, process control. Process control is a tool that helps you adjust the image processing parameters to achieve the best image quality. VXView provides three predefined parameter options for you normal, soft, and hard. You can preset a default parameter from the procedure manager in the setting mode. Should you have a specific parameter you wish to use or change, you can adjust the image processing elements here. Now, Puronpec is our advanced image processing solution, and you can use this for additional adjustments such as sharpening size, tone type, and noise reduction. SPSC or software-based scatter correction is our image processing algorithm and you can choose to apply this to your X-ray image. The x also allows you to adjust post-LUT information here. Here you'll find the basic yet most frequently used tools. You can zoom in or out, use pan tool and more. To see more advanced tools, click here. You can apply free rotate and mirror tools. From the tool section, you can also find undo and redo icon to help you manage your works more efficiently. VXView supports grid line suppression function and you can preset options for grid line suppression or grid suppression as indicated in VXView at the XIPL in the setting mode. This is the grid suppression icon. Here you can choose to remove the grid line automatically or choose to remove vertical or horizontal grids. Stitching function enables you to stitch two or more image into one image. Here you'll see three images ready for stitching. Click pattern matching. You'll have the three images combined to one in a second. You can still select individual images and move it up or down if you need to further adjust the image. VXView also provides auto stitching function or physical matching if it's integrated with the system. You can check the detailed information and prerequisites at our system integration guide. That's it for today's video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.